start running and it, it's very hard to uh, tell which uh, which flights are going by so we were having a look at you know each uh, each recruit that was running by just grown so much as a person I and mean, you could just tell that by the way he carried himself. I um, started to cry. This is everything we sent him and everything that he sent us. We always just tried to keep our letters, you know, very upbeat and positive and silly. She sent him a booger. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever got home first could get the letter out of the mailbox, but they weren't allowed to open it. We would not open the letter until we were all home together. Um, then we watched the ceremony, and uh, you know, I was the one that got to tap him out. I kind of broke down in tears, you know, and just happiness and joy to to see him after all that time. It was a very, uh, very emotional um, moment for us. A mixture of pride and you know, honor for what he was doing. After the tap out, when he was able to come be with us at graduation and we could sit and talk, it was like we didn't miss a beat. You would never even know that we had been apart for so long because it was just, it was different, but it was the same.